Dave the Younger took an intro. Made with a total budget of zero pounds. Because I'm Yorkshire. <laughs> Gaff! Good morning! It is. Oh! Did I just fucking do. Shit. What did I just do? Ah. Uh, Alright. It's Monday. It's going well. Fuck. <laughs> eh. Eh. All good. You'd never know it were broken. Right, so it's Monday. Fucking get off. We're here. It's Monday. We are doing Kel K today. We've already collected. Uh, well, we collected on Friday. We've got four drops starting in Newark, ending in Bedfordshire. 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 And got some bad news. And got some terrible news. Got some tragic. There's a spat. Horrific news. Even agrees with me. Yeah, we're we're not in we're not in the angry daff. We're not in the angry daff. Uh, we're in the uh, shocking, shoddy, shitty, rusty FFS. Ugh. It's like pigeons have been shitting rust. How do pigeons shit rust? Uh, so yeah, we're taking this today. So I'm incognito mode. Thank God. It's been embarrassing getting recognised in this thing. Doors missing a paddle. Oh, great. The roof's smart. The roof's shorter. Can't stand up, can I? Mm. If they popped out, they can pop in. Pop popped in. Popped in. In he, in he is popped. Oh, yeah. We're heading to Newark. Uh, some bad news about this truck. This truck is an older truck, so... Man's driving around with headphones. Um, yeah, it doesn't have Bluetooth. doesn't have any connectabilities whatsoever. It doesn't have... I don't even think it has air, it has an aircon button, but I know for a fact it's not going to work. No point in even trying. So my truck, my truck will be fixed today, uh, but I'll be out in, I've got to sleep in this. But I'll be out tonight in this. So I won't be getting my truck till tomorrow. So basically we're going out today in this. We'll sleep out one day in this, which is one day, it's fine. If you're all awake and I said no, but it's one day. Uh, come back, so we'll come straight back tomorrow, picking up my truck, getting back out on road, so we can have our truck all week. Slow down. It's nothing as serious. Nothing as serious as what I thought it was going to be with this. With my. There's nothing serious with my truck. My truck's. Uh, it's, it's apparently it's a two-hour job to get done. Um, so yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, all this means is there's no way of recording forwards so you can't see me driving so you're gonna miss out all the fun parts of watching me drive and then forgetting to put music on it or forgetting to speed it up you just have to sit there and watch me just drive normally because that's enjoyable isn't it go to stop at fuel station get some fuel get some food get some drink um, then drive just under two hours to newark so i'll let you know what happens i'll get you out in newark yeah Right, see you in a bit. Off in an extremely small yard. Very busy one as well. I've got to reverse this into the smallest fucking area. 1029 AM. So I've got the auto braking trailer on, and he stood right behind the trailer, and the trailer put its brakes on. So, um, we went into that site and they're all like, what the fuck, why are you trying to get in that way? You gotta go down the road, spin round, and then come back and then come in that way. I'm like, well, do you want me just to reverse in? He goes, no, 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 I'm driving forward, you're gonna reverse in here. I'm like, mate, it's gonna be worse reversing in here than it's just reversing off the road. Nah, but you'll be blocking it for customers. But when you're doing unloading and loading, you shouldn't really be fucking having customers in, should you really? Priority here, get it off. No one at risk, health and safety, you know. He's, this trailer's just shit. See, this trailer has auto braking, so it's got sensors on the back of the trailer. And once you get to a certain distance from something, it automatically puts your brakes on. So you put your foot on the brake to try and stop it wobbling like that, because obviously I've got a lot of weight on. The trailer's like, if I'm like, if the cab's here and the trailer's facing here, and the brakes come on, the trailer will do this. And if it's heavy enough, It'll just snap off the pit, the fifth wheel, and just fall on its face. Very rarely happens, but it, you know, it's a possibility it could happen. You put your foot on the brakes slightly to stop it from rocking, 
But because the auto braking has already done its auto function and put the brakes on, as soon as you touch that brake, it slams on. It's like, it, it just anchors all the brakes, which makes the rocking worse. So yeah, don't like it. I don't, I don't like these auto brakes. It's, it's designed for when you reverse it onto a bay. So when you're getting close to the wall, it slowly backs you onto it. But the thing is, because it's auto braking, when you're this far away from the wall, he'll just, he'll keep the brakes on like, no, 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 don't go any further, don't go any further. You need to go a little bit further. He's like, no, no, no. So you put your foot down, like on the accelerator, to get it to move, because you got to force it out of being in brake, and then it just jolts into the frigging door. So yeah, we didn't record there, because we were in... So we didn't record in there, because we were very busy. Uh, there were a lot of people walking about, fall lift driver pretty much up my ass half the time. Surprisingly, it picked me one forks, you know, insert his forks into my anus. Uh, on our way to the next one in Wellingborough. Welling, it's a very posh name, isn't it? Wellingborough. We're off to Wellingborough. Edfordshire and Wellingborough. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Mm. Hopefully I'll get you out of the neck. There are only four pallets. It's not interesting. You've seen a forklift take off pallets, right? How, how much, how much, how interesting can that get? It's not like it's a gigantic cylinder or, you know, it's just pallets. Pallets. No, it's just a three bastard pallets. I don't know what I just said then. I said a word, but it didn't come out as I, as I hoped it would. Interested. Not interested. Yeah, mate. So, I'm just losing my tempo with these traps. Sorry. Mate, right. I don't know how many is coming off here. Uh, hills, tops, hills, tops. There's those still coming off. Christ. Uh, Fight with me. You'll lose. Is it good? Is that, is like, is that like a show garden? Look at all the colours we have. The rainbow. Give me frigging headache. Fucking yeah. How's your day been? It's been alright, yeah. I've just lost my tempo. It's strap. This one every time. Dave the Angry Trucker in his mighty DAF. On the road he rumbles, crushing every path. Scam. He doesn't like driving. Look at the size of that dog. Oh, Jesus, that's a bear. That's a freaking bear. Oof, big dog. Oof. Hey, see, he don't like drivers uh, spinning around on spot because it damages his car park. There we go. So we're going to reverse that for him. Make him happy. He's and in the farm. I'm now in the farm. Hello. John Deere. <laughs> Hello, John Deere. If you move this tractor, it'd be a lot easier for me, but now I've got to do a spin anyway. I've still got to do I'm still ripping up his time, man, because he's a special old lad. Give him horns. That is a sad horn. That is a sad horn. Oh, taking his tree apart. Right, we've got to find the next place we're going to, which is. Fuck me. 
I thought I'd gone to the wrong place, I thought I'd missed one out, but I forgot I'm doing it backwards to front, not front to back. Oh, God. So we've done that one. We're now going to Milton Ernest. Thank God. Sorted. Do you want to watch out there? I'm very boring. Do you want to watch out there? Watch out there. Let's see what we're doing. There you go. It's a little bit more interesting to watch. You will arrive at your destination at 11.32 a.m. Alright then, so it is now, it's about 10 o'clock, uh, we've come to Tredibi at Fawley, we have done all the other deliveries, nothing interesting, we're all boring stuff, so I didn't bother recording it. Um, I finally decided I'm, I'm, coming to, I'm going to bed now, I'm going to go to sleep, um, again, this is not my truck, uh, from now on, I refuse to sleep in any other truck other than mine. Um, obviously this truck hasn't been checked, it hasn't been, no one sleeps on this truck, it's a day truck and i didn't realize i've only just realized that this truck doesn't have curtains oh it does it has one half but it has no curtains yeah so uh hmm. you go if you walk by you'll be able to see me sleeping cool can't have no special day of alone time nope i want to get arrested for it so man's going to sleep christian style uh, pff, ow. This fucking roof! Do my best thing! Bam me head like three times! Fucking thing. Just stick it in window. Just it hanging out window like, yeah, you can't see in. Is there no curtains up there? Ah, 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 ha ha! Hello. Never mind. We have, we have, we have sussed the issue. The issue has been sussed. Yeah, you're gonna watch me do it. Is this even the right one? It is. Why would you take it off, you? I bet they're all snapped. No, they're not. It's just me complaining. Ah, I've got no curtains. Just look for them, Dave. That's one. Just another 25 to go. So, what do you do before you went to bed? Oh, put me, installed me curtains. What's jammed? Why is it? There we go. Ah! Aha! No Christian sleeping for me tonight. <laughs> these really. Oh, have you tried? Have you tried these? Banging. Honestly, if you buy, if you're out, buy these. They are oh, next level amazingness. Obviously, don't eat them if you're allergic to peanuts. You know, it's stupid. Don't do that. That was like the central curtain, but it looks like it's all been ripped to shreds. Oh no, that's the bed cover. Oh, I wonder where that was. Cause it's, the bottom one's just foam. This, I put my bedding on, but it's just foam. So that's, why does people do this? Why, 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 why do you, why do you dismantle the whole fucking thing? It is a mess in here, but you know, shut up. How fucking close, how close is that? I'm gonna sit up and bam your head. Um, it's claustrophobic in here. Look how, look how close, do you see how close that is? Look how close. It's close. Too close. Slow down. Nice. What's that? Is it? Is that the cabbie? One, one. This truck is so fucking old. Oh, we got one light. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a singular light. That's right. These don't work. The other one on the other side don't work. That one's obviously that popped out and broken. It's a. Uh, it's not a nice truck to be in. Personally, if it's me, because this bed's so close, it is literally just there. I'd be getting that taken out because we don't we don't use bunk beds because we don't we're only solos. So you can ask to get this removed. It can be taken. Oh God, fucking lighters and everything. Ugh. Yeah, you can you can be asked. Look, you can ask to take these out. You don't have to keep them in. Um, the only reason I keep mine in is because I use it for storage. So it is a lot of storage space. These this truck, as you can see, the storage isn't amazing. You've only got look, two short ones, a half size one, which that's big enough to fit. Uh, microwave in easy. You can put a microwave in there. Piss. This one doesn't have under the bed storage here, but I believe if you lift this up, yeah, you have plenty of storage in there. Wow. Oh look. 
Oh, more curtains! More fucking curtains! It's fucking collecting curtains! And an Ivis. Was that my f Is that my fucking Ivis? That's my fucking Ivis! That's my daft Ivis! I've been looking for that fucking ages, you fucking robbing bastards! Wait, right, what's in here? Uh, sat nav holders, uh, nasal inhaler. Okay, whatever that is. That cardboard's 35 quid. It's a bit extortionate, but whatever. Uh, I'm guessing this is an ADR bag. I'd imagine so. I don't know what's in, what's in this bag. What's this? It could be a head in it. It could be a head. It could be a fucking head. But what the fuck? Boots? What the f Boots? Boots? Fucking boats! Like no one uses this truck, so what the fuck? What's, what's... It's an ADR bag. It is, it's an ADR bag. Well, that's good, because I forgot to bring mine. So win-win for me, ha! <laughs> but they're, they're, what size are they? They're definitely not 13s, so they're not going to fit me. What the fuck's this? Some... Is that piss? That's piss! That's fucking piss! Dirty bastards, that's piss! Look at it foam up! Why would you put piss on that bed for? Just throw it out. Fucking, who's been stealing this? This, nah, man, this is stolen goods. We've caught a thief. We've caught a fucking thief. Nah, man, nah, nah. What the fuck is it? Stolen. This is stolen shit. We've caught a thief. This is a. Uh... Spare Suzu lines, some spare goggles, which I'll need them. Oh shit! Oh shit! Fuck! Shit! So currently, I am at Tredibi Forley. Uh, as we all know, I'm going to keep these out, right? We're keeping these out. Um, shit! What the f oh, fuck's sake? No! Like I was saying, we're at Tredibi Forley, which is... you. So we're at Tredibi Forley, okay. So as I've said, um, the issue I've just figured out, the issue I've just I've just thought of, I don't have a hard hat, and I need a hard hat for this site. I didn't have my goggles either, but luckily there's some spare. On the, I, I didn't see that. Oh fuck's sake! I didn't see that. Hopefully they have a spare hard hat. If not, we're gonna have issues. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna have problems. They should have a spare hard hat. They should at least one. This is why I hate this is why I hate changing trucks because you gotta change so much. Like I've got to get me sat now, my phone charger, I've got to get me straps, I've got to get me bedding, I've got to get, you know, all the shit that I require. Pens. Which by the way, fucking gone missing. They'll, they'll, have, a, they'll have a spare out of that. What are they gonna say? No, you can't come on site. It's they're gonna say no you can't come on site. Fuck! Right then, so I'm off to bed. Um I'm tired. Um so yeah. I'll see him on. Fucking nightmare. All right, and good morning. Uh, as you can tell, we're back to Warehouse 42. We found it easy this time. The sat nav did try to take me down a few questionable roads, but we avoided. So all we're doing today is we're collecting these polymer parts, these little plastic beads to go to Leeds at Geofabrications, to then go back to the yard to collect my truck, because fuck this shit. Um, yeah, cool. Right, I'll, I'll get strapping up. Flash 
Right then, I've got a good idea for a TikTok, so we're gonna make a TikTok right quick before we leave. Come on, brakes, fuck it, why not? The lads are gonna get involved with me, aren't you? Man's got friends. So uh, just made a quick video with the two lads in there and uh, the lad says that he's missed it, don't believe. Yeah, so uh, the lad told me that his lass, because he's called his lass and says, I've just met Angry Dave. And he said, I don't believe you. So he says, can I get a picture with you so I can prove that I've seen you? I said, we'll do one better. We'll do a video. I've got to have a 45 minute break. I'm at three hours now. I'm gonna have it the last place. I'm gonna take it the last place I took it last time, but I can't lay out grass this time because the grass is fucking wet. So yeah, we're off to Lee's now. Drop this off at Geo Fabs, and then tomorrow we will collect our truck, my truck. I can't believe we've been driving for a while and it's still the air isn't. There's something wrong with it. this trailer. There's something wrong with this trailer. Sometimes it's fine, other times it's losing air. So I don't know what's fucking. I don't know what's wrong with it. I want to break here. Oh, glorious. Take my hands off. I'm sweating. Right, we're on break then. Uh, the air is it's better now. So, yeah. See you in a bit. Miss me, I've missed you. You're fucking filthy though, gee, disgusting. Give you a wish tomorrow. Two minutes. Run you into a fucking wall. Steve? Huh? What are you still doing here? Call out. Call out. Where you been? Where are you going? James Riley and I've just been from Red Row because Adam Brock is Red Airline. What wrong with Riley's? Eternal Strap. Ah. Did he call you all the way to Hull? No, I've just... He's managed to strap up what he's got safely. I just need to correct everyone else before he goes back out tonight. Mine fixed. Yeah. yeah. All goes glorious. Is someone taking it out? Are you, are you, are you taking it out? Nobody's taking it out. Why is it got shit over it? Wish you had. Could have washed it. No. What a fucking mess. Man, turn these fuckers off. Like an idiot driving one of these around. So we all got a letter on our cars saying. <coughs> <coughs> It didn't say that, but what it did say is they're doing this road, so don't park on this street because you know we're gonna be tarmacking and doing whatever. And I'm like, 
I am not, I am not bringing my dose challenger and have it tarmacked. So, it is a good car. I'm not gonna lie, right? Oh, shit. I ain't, don't get me wrong. This Civic, this Civic, it's a good Civic, right? I like that Civic, okay? It has done me, it's done me proud. It's done me well, all right? I have, I have no issues with Civic. This Civic I've had for, I think for five years and it has not had one issue, apart from brake. So I've had all brake pads changed. Um, I even got a sensor fix, so it tells you when brake pads are getting low now. So that's cool. Um, yeah, I, I, I love that. I do like this Civic. I do, right? It's a good car. Like I say, I've never had any issues with it. I've never had any major issues with it. It's been a solid, reliable car. It's just not a Dodge Challenger, is it? If you want to know, I shall be selling my Civic. It comes with these wheels and it comes with the original wheels, three of which are in good condition. One of them is uh, really bad. Um, yeah, it's, uh, it's, a, it's pretty much a standard Civic Type R with alloy wheels and an exhaust system. Exhaust sounds really nice, right? It is a nice sounding Civic. I, I'll, I'll turn it on so you can listen. I'll turn it on, I'll rev it. I'll tell you, we've got, let's do it. Don't run it from cold, because that's a stupid idea, we don't do that. Now you tell me that doesn't sound nice. That almost sounds as nice as the Dodge, but it doesn't look anywhere near as nice as the Dodge. He doesn't sound as good as the Dodge. I'm, I'm lying. I'm going to sell this Civic. All right. I'm going to put it up on uh, Facebook, eBay, whatever. All right. It's yours. If you want it, it's yours. All right. What I'll do, whoever wins it, all right, I'm going to throw in some Dave Denker Trucker merch. I'll even sign it if you want me to. If you, if you really want me to. I'm not going to do it if you don't want me to do it. You know what I mean? But if you want me to sign it, I will sign it. I'll sign it somewhere you... Oh, fuck no. Wait, this is the only issue it's got. The paint lacquer, the lacquer on the paint here is gone. I got the jet wash at work and I pretty much go. There was bird shit on there and the jet wash in there is from, it's made for trucks and it's powerful as shit. And I, I was about this far away from it and it just stripped the lacquer off. So it, all this here looks like a dick. <laughs> uh, it's missing its lacquer. Um, it's noticeable when you, when you wash it because obviously the rest is clean and you've just got that which just needs lacquering but that's the only damage on it apart, apart from that that's not damage that's just, just that just needs clipping back in I just can't be arsed I don't know how should we try and do it now? why not? why not eh? why not? let's try, let's try and fix this look I'm doing this for you alright the person who's going to win this I'm doing this for you not for myself I don't need to do this yeah. ah. no my right. fuck That's for you. Whoever buys that, I've just done that for you. I've saved you a job. You're welcome. You're very welcome. Shit. Keep forgetting that I'm here. Really good condition. Back seats, really good condition. They're probably best condition here because, you know, no one sits in them. Um, problems with the interior. The gear knob, you can see all flaw now, can't you? It's disgusting. The gear knob, the red bits have come out and it's scratched because I wear, I've got a wedding ring and it's not, you know, it's not really good design. Yes, it is filthy down there. I know. I know. I'm not a woman. I do clean cars. It's just that I ain't cleaned this one in a while. Um, other problems. See, I don't get this right. So, this has been like this since I got the car. See, look, this is all nice. I think this has been replaced. So, this is nice and new looking. Yeah. Why is that one like that? Eh? Who the fuck? A lot of married men getting out of this car, scratching the shit out of it. Bastards. It's Bluetooth, it's got signal, it's got radio, it's got everything. It's also got USB port, so if you want to watch like Simpsons or Family Guy or whatever, or Need for Speed, you know, because that's more adult, uh, plug it in. It's a TV as well. It plays It plays video. The mileage when I got it was 92,000. It's now 106,000. It is, it's, it's done miles. It's done miles. But like I say, it is bang on it's a good solid car i like it. i liked it 
I still like it. To be honest, I enjoy driving it. Even though I've got this other car, I still enjoy driving this car because it just, it's quick. It's a little quick car. Here, Rev. When it gets warm enough as well, it starts popping and banging. So yeah, one of you lucky people could own this car. Eh? A Dave the Anger Trucker or uh, exclusive. Is it coming from me? And you know, you can trust me. I'll tell you all the faults with it. I'll tell you all the flaws with it, which I have done. Um, and yeah, and you get to meet me. You know, bonuses, bonuses everywhere. Oh. Oh. Morning. Oh, we're back. Oh God. Yeah. Yeah. Why you not been tested? Oh, enjoy. Good. Best work as well. Morning. Employee of the month, June, Darren. My name's never up there. <laughs> I might be one. <laughs> Dirty. <laughs> it's a mess. It's an absolute pig stain here. Oh, get in there. Get in there. We are back in the mighty daff. Oh, we are back. We are so back. We are so back. Oh. We've never been so back. We have never been so back. We are back. Back we are. Oh, yes. We are back in the black daff. Yeah. <laughs> The ma, the ma, the ma, ma, the ma, ma, the mechanics have done it again. Oh, perfect. It's driving like a dream again. <laughs> I'm, honestly, I'm going to start my own language. Up. I'm going to start. I'm going to start my own language. Yeah, I'm going to start my own language. I'm going to start my own language. I'm start my own language. It's just going to be me. me, 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 me. Do you understand what I just said? Mm. Might be an ugly trailer, but it's a gorgeous truck. For people that are asking as well, what happened to the black trailer? It went back. It wasn't ours, it was a hired trailer. So we haven't got the black trailer anymore. Sucks, but that's how it is, mate. What the fuck's this? Is the guys trying to tell me something, eh? So today on What the Fuck Are We Doing? We are going to Leeds, dropping off those bags we picked up yesterday, because we they closed well they didn't close but they stopped unloading at three o'clock that's four dave there you go well done uh they stopped at three o'clock yesterday so by the time i got there they'd have been shut so we're off there today deliver all these bags off and then we haven't got any other jobs after that so no doubt jack will let us know okay, what am i doing what am i doing hey we're waiting now we've got built air up in the truck because the truck's got no air uh Power interruption. Sensor fault. Sensor fault. Security breach. Driving without card. Well, that's rest. <laughs> I just realised I didn't put my manual input in, but luckily on this truck, if you don't do it, it does put you down as rest. So, I'm luckily I'm not done as doing any more work. I'm going to give you some advice now. 
trucks, not all trucks do what my truck does, right? If you put your card in and forget about it, I think it gives you about two minutes to do something. If you don't do it, it automatically fills it in for you. So it, it might, you know, it might be lucky and put automatic rest in, but you might be unlucky and it puts automatic work in, right? Here's a tip. When you put your card in, do nothing else, right? When you put your card in, get distracted by nothing. Just watch it, do that. And then do your manual entry, all right? Manual, if you, if you don't know what a manual entry is, because there is a lot of people, because you don't get trained it, if you don't know what it is, all it is, is basically you telling the card what you have done, why you've not been at work, all right? So say you took your card out at five o'clock, okay? This is how easy it is, it's so, it's so easy. Say you took your card out at five o'clock, right? So after that, it has no more information about you. So what did you do after five o'clock? Did you leave immediately? Did you just get your stuff and just get out of there? Or did you go in office, talk to the boss? You know, did you do, did, were you still working? So say you didn't actually leave work until half past five, right? Your manual entry then has to tell the card that you worked until, you worked another half an hour. So it is, you just go into it, you put other work, yes, and then you'll see the cross hammers, and it'll say today's date, not yesterday's date. So you have to go back to yesterday's date. That'll take you to the last time it was in. So it'll take you to five o'clock. You just go to the minutes, which is 5.30, put 30 in, right? Then you press OK, that is your cross hammers done. After that, a new line will show up. You put it on rest, bed, right? OK that, and that's, till you start at work. So if you start at work at six, it is now 6.05, right? You put work in till six. You know, sorry, you put rest in till six, and then your last line, cross hammers, you worked until you've now been working since six till 6.05. It's very simple. I don't know why it's so confusing some people. As long as that's legal, it's fine. As long as that's what you actually did, it's fine. And you can't get caught out by it. You know, if, Say you've put in, you finished at five o'clock, but then, you know, you've moved another truck somewhere else and didn't put a card in. And then Vosa's like, well, that truck moved with that card. So who moved that truck? And then they find out you moved it. And it's like, well, you finished work at that time. So how can you move that truck? You now mind you, you've moved a truck without a card in, which is bad enough, but you've also not finished work. Oh, so now let's get in deeper into this. And we found out, oh, you've been driving all these trucks without cards. Oh, you, you've been working since this time. Oh, you came in at this time. But didn't... It's a spiral of shit hidden your way. Do things right. We're going to get off then. Um, yeah. It's good to be back in the truck. It's got to be back in my truck. It's got to be back. It's got to be back. It's got to be back in my truck. Every mile of battle, Dave leaves his mark. On TikTok, he's a legend. So we've arrived. Please wait while your call is connected. Call is currently unavailable. Please try again later. So we're parked here. Sorry, it was not possible to connect your call. Yeah, I know. I've bled horns out. I've done everything. I'm not sure if there's anyone in there or not. That's not working. I hate the fact. Why is that connected to a mobile phone? We're stuck here until someone gives us a shout and says, yeah, we can come in. So I'm just going to watch a film. I'm going to watch a movie. I'm going to watch a movie. None of this is your fault. Aquaman. She had to save your father. Tell me. Don't be angry. Is currently unavailable. Fuck Amber Heard. Wow. Okay, so today is... You would stop, wouldn't you? You would stop. As soon as I put the camera on you, you would. I tell you what, look over there instead. Right? You see this tree? Oh, there you go. It's very fucking windy. I also did something stupid yesterday. Um, I left the window open when I went home. So the cab is now soaked. Like, I'm sat on piss went through seat here. So I've, I've turned the heated seat on to dry out the seat. But all it's doing is basically steaming my ass. That's all it's doing. It's just steaming. The cold, the wet, because the seat's drenched. The, you know, the bottom, 
the bottom seat is drenched, right? Because I left the window open. I left the window open this much. Okay, let enough rain in to soak it through. So, the heated seat is now converting that water into steam, which is now soaking into my anus, causing me to have a steamy bum hole. It's not ideal. When I get out of the truck, I'm just gonna have like a ring of steam coming out of my ass. All right, so we've arrived at R and M Hayes. Is it R M S Hayes or just R and M Hayes? Um, this is this is where it's come in. I know you missed it. You you missed it all. It looks like another driver's been before because that electric box has been destroyed. I pulled up. I reversed in down there and he says, uh, is, is that for us? I went, well, do you see any other place that requires uh, a load? So I'm delivering to this house, maybe. I didn't record the loading process because it was onto a bay for one and two, the camera was dead. Um, we could, we could record the offload because this is like to be funny as shit when he runs into warehouse when he gets further up here because he's not going to get that off. It's taking too long and it's raining, so you're in here. You you, you know what happens. It just, I think you've only got two more to do, so you, you're missing out on two more, all right? So you can sit here with me, enjoy the nice warmth, and find out what we're doing next. So it's less than an hour, it's 50, we are 50 minutes away from Bradford, right? But we can't get there until two o'clock for a load that's due on Tuesday. So we're not even delivering it. We're not even fucking delivering it. Why are we picking it up? We can pick it up on Monday. So I'm currently at Expect. <clears throat> so I'm currently at Expect. I've just been loaded. Two lads just walked up to me. A machine gun Kelly lookalike, and the other one, I, don't know, I forget what it looks like. But yeah, came up. He said, I want to help Dave. I'm like, all right, mate. Uh, this is exactly what, this is what he would have seen, right? You all right, Dave? You all right, mate? I watch you on YouTube. Cool. I'm going to do these curtains up now, yeah? And I did, and then he walked off. Either I scared him off, or he didn't, want to really, he didn't really want to talk that much. He watches me YouTube, so he'll be watching this. Look, I get it. I get it. I do, I do get it, right? It's, it takes a lot of balls to come up to me and say hello. I get that, right? You, you've come up and you've said hello. But then your brain's gone blank. I can tell. It's, it's the same with everyone. They come up, say hello, and then it's like... I've now got to have a conversation with this man. Just talk about something. You just stand there and just be like, You alright, Dave? You alright, mate? This, this is what you all need to do, right? You need to think of a conversation after hello. Alright, that's how you need to do You need to go, hello, hey, Dave. I watch you on TikTok, right? That's that's good. But don't end it there, because what I meant to say to that, thanks. Oh, you're a legend. Da. Ah, brilliant. Well done. Fantastic. Stunning. I tell you what, what we'll do is we'll walk, we're gonna do that. We're gonna walk over and we're gonna get him on camera. And he's gonna be like, what the fuck's this for? And I'll say, you'll see on YouTube. Alright, let's go do that. By any chance have you seen that blonde hair kid? Have you seen that blonde hair kid? It looks like Machine Gun Kelly. He's a driver. He's got blonde hair. Is that him there, Feebo? Feebo. Right, we'll go have a look. You will notice me when camera comes into you fucking with me. Watch this. You ready? This is you. Now then. Right, Machine Gun Kelly. And there you go. So now you've watched this video, you're right here. You're not going to understand at all what I'm talking about, but you will do when you watch this video on YouTube. So now this confused face makes sense. Dickhead.